Hi guys, welcome back to Summer Ben's Vocabulary. Yes, in this video, I'm going to be telling you six sentences you think is correct. Yeah, I'm going to be giving you six mistakes you often make when speaking English. Yeah, I'm going to correct them for you. Yeah, so let's start, guys. My number one, number one. Now, the use of me and I. Me and I is often used wrongly in speaking. Yes. So now this is the incorrect sentence. Saying James and me are best friends. Or saying me and James are best friends. That's wrong. To say James and me are best friends. Now the right sentence for that should be James and I are best friends. Then now before the pronoun. James then and I are best, are best friends. Yes. So guys. Do not say me and James or say me and somebody, somebody else, me and Joy, Joy and me, me and Precious, Precious and me, they're wrong. So you should stop saying me and or the now and me. You should stop saying that. So the right word to say is the now and the pronoun I. The now and the pronoun I should come. Okay. Now, my number two. Number two. Now this is often this mistake is often made by uh, using of that word P E P P E R I S H pepperish. There's nothing like pepperish. Saying, oh, this food is pepperish. There's nothing like pepperish. You do not say pepperish, you say peppery. Peppery, not pepperish. So do I hear you say pepperish? Do not say pepperish, say peppery. This food is peppery. Yes, when the food contains so much pepper, you don't say this food is peppery. You say this food is peppery. Okay. So, my number three. Number three. This mistake is frequently made. You don't, you don't say my stomach is paining me. Don't say my stomach is paining me. You say my stomach aches. My stomach aches. Not paining. My stomach aches. Just as you have headache. Yeah, my head aches. My stomach aches. Oh, my arm aches. Oh, my back aches. You say aches. Stop saying my stomach is paining me. Oh, my back is paining me. Oh, my waist is paining me. Yeah, you say my stomach aches. If it aches a lot, you say my stomach aches a lot. Yes. Oh, you can express yourself by saying my stomach aches a lot. Yeah. So you should stop saying paining me. Yes. Now, my number four. The use of um, Dan and two. Dan and two. Now, the wrong sentence. People say, um, I prefer coffee than tea. I prefer coffee than tea. It's wrong to say I prefer coffee than tea. You say I prefer coffee to tea. When you use the word prefer, it goes with to. Use to. So the done is when you use like. Like. Oh, I like this than this. I like brother than sister. Okay. Now, so do not say I prefer this to and than this again. You say I prefer this. That was my number four. My number five goes does like the use of between and among use of between and among there is a certain and there's a certain sentence you use between and there is a certain sentence you use among you do not use them anyhow yeah now this sentence is incorrect saying share the oranges between the boys share the oranges between the boys you don't say between the boys because the number of boys is not specified there then it can be more than two boys it can be ten boys so you do not say share the oranges between the boys. You say share the oranges among the boys. Now when you have, when when it is specified that it is two boys, so now you can say you can say share the oranges between the two boys. That is when you have the two there. You share the oranges between the two boys. But when they say just boys, share the oranges among the boys. So do not make that mistake of saying share the oranges between the boys, or or divide. The mangoes between the guys. It is among. So guys, that was my number five. Now my number six, which is the last. Now the use of um. Um, lands and borrowed, lands and borrowed. Now this is the wrong English. Saying I learned the book from Shola. I learned the book from Shola. It is wrong. You say I borrowed the book from Shola. Borrowed is when you collect something from somebody and learn, learned or learned is when you what? Lend something to somebody. You are giving the person the thing. 
So when you are giving out, you are lending. When you are collecting, you are borrowing. So stop saying, I learned this book from um, such a person. Or I learned the money from so No, I borrowed. But if, you, if, if that from is changed to two, that is if you are the one um, borrowing, okay, I learned the book to him. I borrowed the book from him. So stop saying, I learned the book from him. You say, I borrowed the book from him. Guys. So that is the end of today's video, guys. See you in my next video. I love you guys. Please like, comment, share this video, and subscribe to this channel. Thank you, guys. I love you.